Hi, Gary Gregg here down at Golden Gate Palms Nursery in Richmond. I want to talk to you a little bit about avocado trees today. Now, the date today is April 19th, 2018. Okay? What does that mean? That means it's the time of year where these avocado trees will start throwing out tons of flowers and their new foliage will come after the flowers. Now, you'll see here that this tree looks incredibly sad because all these leaves are turning brown, they're turning yellow right here. And I get tons of phone calls from people this time of year completely distressed about their trees. Gary, 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 my tree's dying, my tree's dying, what am I gonna do? I'm like, wait a minute, it's springtime, what do you bet it's flowering? What do you bet it's gonna push out its new growth? Well, this flowering process takes all kinds of energy from this tree. And the only way it can get this energy is it has to sacrifice its leaves. You'll see these leaves just fall, fall, fall this time here. But as you can see, look what happens right after the flowers come out. You have these beautiful flushes of red new foliage coming out. So this tree will completely fill out. Now it's really important this time of year, the tree loses all of its leaves. You want to make sure you've painted your tree white. Super important. Okay. If it gets completely sunburned, it's going to get all messed up. We don't want that. So one good thing about the leaf drop though, is you'll end up with this wonderful mulch underneath the trees. There is a compound in the leaves of avocado trees that create a symbiotic environment that prevents fungal action on the roots. And so these leaves actually will release this chemical into this ground and prevent these roots from having root rot. So you want to leave every single leaf you can underneath your tree, and you want copious amounts of mulch and loose soil. As you can see, we planted this tree up on a mound, right? That promotes really good drainage and also airflow. The roots love airflow. We have a lot of clay soil here in the Bay Area. The last thing you want to do is dump your tree down, cover it all in clay, no mulch. That's not good for a tree. This is what you want to do. So anyway, when your trees turn yellow, Right when they're flowering, please don't call me. Watch my video. And you'll see that uh, it's actually a natural process, no problema. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.